Hello everybody, this is Starman, and welcome back to Let's Play Fallout 2. Well, we're here in the Hubologist base again, but you will note that this is a completely different save. Because I went, checked some guides and some discussion boards, and found out that, uh, yeah, there is a bit of disagreement about what happens here and how to get out of it. Now, many people insist that it is possible that you can just use your repair skill to disable the force field. Other people, like myself, keep saying that, well, I keep getting a message that says I can't repair that. And they say, well, you have to do a repair on the force field emitter, the little conical thing next to the force field. I do not have the option to do that. So I think there's some <coughs> difference between the versions of the game that are out there that are playable. The only thing I found that works in the end is that you have to have a tool, just a simple tool, and you can use it on the force field emitter to disable it. And this apparently works in the Enclave base at the end as well. You fail to lower the force field. You fail to lower the force field. On the third try, I am able to clip the wires to lower the force field. And what's really funny is that even though I have killed Great Leader and slaughtered every other guard in this place and all the celebrities and the cultists in robes, uh, these guards up at the front are not doing a darn thing to stop me from leaving. And the guards up top will also not do a darn thing to stop me from leaving. I've actually played through this... This will be the third time this morning. Because unfortunately... I wound up running into a tremendous lag burst the minute I got back to San Francisco. So I've decided this time that we're going to go ahead and fight through this one fight, and if we wind up having a six-minute chapter, so be it. Okay, I probably will load at reload at this point, because I do not want Sulik getting blown up. Even though we are fast approaching the point where... I am going to have to leave some of my companions behind on account of uh, there's no real way to navigate the final level with a uh, full party. I'll go ahead and kill this guard first. Okay, nobody saw that. Nobody can complain about it. Good. Hi there, soldier. How you doing? Nice day. Just leaves me with one jackass and a robe to punch.
And so we bring it in to the Hobologist cult. Well, okay, except for the guy's topside, who also, curiously enough, will not have any idea that we just killed their leadership and be blissfully unaware as we start pounding the snot out of them as well. Why? I'm nothing but a completist. And damn it, Vic! And we will do this one more time. This is my purgatory, isn't it? I'm going to have to keep playing this level over and over. And having Selleck die horribly, even though he is my... Well, Stollard and okay, admittedly he is down to about half hit points. And force field is back on. Okay, I'm too tired to do any more doctoring. So, let us try this again. These aren't the blue boxes that we can search, unfortunately. And a good thing I did heal Sulik because he just got critically hit and knocked down. Me get knocked down. But we get up again. You're never going to knock me down. And so, having once again made the wasteland safe for decent folk to not be harassed by robe-wearing religious fanatics, exit our heroes through the front gate, stage left. And now I am bloody well going to save the game here. To be safe and for good measure...
Alright, I've given everybody a super stem pack. And just to start things off on the right foot. I'm going to start with this guard over here. Okay, well, that was number 1200 XP, and so, were our heroes having twice defeated the religious fanatics, laying siege to the city, exit our heroes through the front door, stage right. kicked in again. You know what? I'm not even mad at this point. Because we finally, finally got through that damn base and are on our way to being able to meet the She-Emperor and get to the end of the game and put this whole wretched experience behind us. Well, playing through this and having the lag and constantly having everybody get injured the vexing part about this is it's not even... I'm not even sure what's causing this, because if I hit the inventory key, it'll lag a bit, but then I can move my cursor around and there's no trouble with everything. You know, it's just fine. And you'll note that uh, I am carrying the Gek with me now, as opposed to leaving it in the trunk of my car. I grabbed it when I got the tool, and there is a reason for that, but uh, we will get into that in a future chapter. For now, though, I think I'm going to go ahead and sign off and muddle through this so that you don't have to watch me slowly drag my way through San Francisco, and I don't have to make small talk for the ten minutes it takes me across the map. So uh, thank you all for watching. I promise we'll have something more amusing, if not necessarily more exciting, next time, and we will see you then.